Hey everyone, I hope you're well. So today's video is a big boohoo haul and it's one of those ones where I pretty much like everything I got. As usual, I will be trying everything on so you can see exactly how it all looks and I will leave all the links to everything in the description box below. So without further ado, let's get to it. Let's start with the kind of muted items and then we'll get into some colour, shall we? So the first thing I purchased is this little play suit. You guys know how much I love my play suits. I'm very, very into the kind of um, gingham, black and white monochrome trend and I love off the shoulder items. So this play suit just combines all of that. It's really nice, the material is quite nice and thick. It feels like a lot more expensive than some Boohoo items I've previously purchased. I have already worn this because it came straight away and I was like, oh I love it so much, I definitely need it for the weekend. It's kind of one of those things you can throw on with a denim jacket in the summer and just know you look good in. I like that it clinches you in at the waist. The shorts are really nice length, they're not too short so you don't want to show any bottom but they're still very flattering on the legs. And I obviously love that it's off the shoulder as well because it just, it's kind of like sexy but in a very like subtle way. So I really really love this play suit and I think I'm going to get a lot of wear out of it this summer. I'm also into the whole kind of mesh and embellished trend that is such a mouthful um, this summer. I really really like it and I picked up this. It's kind of like a cropped long sleeved mesh top, see through so you would have to wear like a little vest top or a bra, or black bra underneath it, but it is embellished with these kind of gold, black and grey sequins, and it's just really pretty. I really liked how it looked on the model, on the website, but it's kind of still sexy, but in a kind of like covered up way. You're showing a little bit of skin, but it's long sleeved, so it's not too much. I do really like this, and I'm looking forward to wearing it. This is probably going to be one of those that lasts me all year round because of the long sleeves. I bought two um, of these t-shirts. They're kind of like, I'd call them like a boyfriend, like a baggy boyfriend t-shirt. I think they're a nice staple to have. I like the sleeve length and the fact that they are kind of rolled up at the end. Very flattering on the arms if you're embarrassed of your bingo wings like I am sometimes. But I really really like this. Great with leggings or tucked into jeans. I also got this in a mustard colour, hello, look at me, I am adding colour to my wardrobe. I'm not sure how I feel about this one, the colour is very um, intense, it's not for everyone, not everyone's going to like this shade, but I do really like it, and again, I think it'll look nice tucked into black jeans. Got back over already. I picked up another play suit. You're gonna to have to let me know what you think about this because on first impressions, I loved it. But I'm not entirely sure. Once I just tried it on, I was a bit hesitant. So it's a really beautiful black, almost like silky fabric um, play suit with this gorgeous like lace um, crochet detailing around the, what do you call that? Neckline, but it also goes down around the shorts, so it kind of looks like a dress, like an open dress with some shorts underneath. I absolutely love it, but I feel like it makes me look a tiny bit like I'm dressing up for Halloween. I don't know, It's I feel like I look like Wednesday Adams or something in it. Because the collar is quite like, the collar sticks up I think around my neck, which makes it look a little bit like gothic. But I do absolutely love it, so I am unsure. I also love the sleeves and the fact they are kind of like floaty, but again I think this adds to the whole kind of like Halloween look. So you will have to let me know what you think about this in the comments. Please let me know yes or no. Also I think that's definitely more of like a winter um, clothing piece. I think it's a little bit too hot to wear in the summer, especially in this heat right now. I am boiling. Okay, this one's a little bit bizarre, bear with me. Basically I was going on a fancy dress last weekend and it was a myths or legends fancy dress party. So I decided, I decided to make use of this pastel hair I've got going on here and decided to be a unicorn. I concocted um, like a horn made out of like the cardboard from the loo rolls and wrapped my head around it. I'll insert a picture here. But I placed this order just before then and I was kind of looking for something that I could wear as like this costume. And I found this. It is a swimsuit, perfect for summer, and it is holographic. I didn't end up wearing it in the end because I had something a little bit brighter and more kind of disgustingly pink, but 
I kind of do want to keep this. It's got a really nice low back, which I think is very sexy, but a very high neck as well at the top, which I haven't really seen in many kind of swimsuits. It is disgusting and very holographic and very tacky, but I kind of love it at the same time. I'm going to show you this bag quickly before I get onto some dresses. I saw this and I fell in love with it but they do have a black one so I think I might return this and pick up the black one instead because I think I'll get more wear out of it. I feel like this kind of tan um, suede colour won't suit every outfit but I absolutely love it. I love the size. It looked a lot smaller on the website so when it came and it was this roomy I was really impressed. I'll be able to fit a lot of stuff in there like my vlogging camera, makeup bag, like notepads, loads of stuff, even my iPad I could fit in there. And it also has the adjustable long strap which I absolutely love. This is like a must have for bags. I love wearing my bags kind of across body so an adjustable long strap is like a must have for when I'm purchasing bags. I love the kind of hippie like, look it has, I love the material, the, like the suede and the fake leather, the braiding and then the big um, kind of western belt buckle here as well. But I do think I'm going to return it and pick up the black. But yeah, I love it. I really, really do love it. Right, I also picked up some dresses. My sister is having her engagement party in a couple of weeks. I think it will be the week after this video goes live. And um, yeah, I'm just looking for a nice summery dress to wear to it. She has kind of given me and my mum a colour theme. She said that it'd be great if we could wear like um, a rose gold or a peach or a kind of pinky shade because she's wearing a little bit of that as well. With that in mind, I picked up these two dresses. I'm not sure that either of these are what I will be wearing. I think they are a little bit too formal and I'd like to look a little bit more young and hip because these do make me look a little bit old and mature but I wanted to show you them anyway. First is this peachy long summer dress. It is absolutely beautiful. It's a little bit too long on me and I think that adds to the fact that it makes me look a little bit older than I am but I love it and I would probably take it up if I was to keep it. It has a nice low kind of um, neckline and nice beautiful floaty sleeves. It clinches you in at the waist and then it floats down and out and I absolutely love this. I would say this is perfect for like a summer wedding or like a summer garden party or something like that but I'm not sure for like an engagement party in a like in a fancy pub would suit this entirely so let me know what you think and I also bought this now I didn't realize but this is pretty much completely see-through I kind of do want to keep it though I like it I don't know when I would wear this but I love it it's an off-the-shoulder kind of mesh dress the whole skirt part is mesh as well which means it's see-through and it has this like underbody how do you say it? It's like a body with a mesh skirt on top. I hope that makes sense. It is very revealing, but I love it. I need. I have no idea when I would wear this, but I, I kind of love it. I definitely couldn't wear this to the party. I would embarrass myself. I could like really imagine this looking nice in a pretty photo shoot, but I'm not sure if I'd actually wear it out the house. Finally, I purchased this. I got this quite a while ago, actually, but I thought I'd include it in on this haul because it is still available online. It is a, another off the shoulder maxi dress. It's like a nice minty green shade with a nice like pink floral pattern on it. Again, I think this would be really nice for a wedding. It looks quite tacky on the hanger, but once I'm wearing it, I think that it looks quite nice and a little bit more expensive than it was. Yeah, again, let me know what you think. It's definitely too big for me, but I have kept it for a summer wedding just in case. So that is everything. I really hope you enjoyed this haul. Let me know what your favourite piece. Let me know what your favourite item from the haul was. Also let me know, like send me a link on Twitter if you see anything that might look appropriate for my sister's engagement party. I'd love to see what you guys would kind of wear to that occasion. Have a lovely week and I will see you soon.